Hearing that you have a bladder tumor can be scary. If your doctor has suggested a transurethral resection of your bladder tumor, also known as TURBT, this video will help you understand the procedure and make you feel more comfortable as you move through the next steps in your treatment plan. What is TURBT? TURBT stands for Transurethral Resection of Bladder Tumor, which is a surgical procedure to remove tumors from the bladder wall. TURBT is an initial treatment for bladder cancer. This procedure may be used to determine if there is cancer, or it may also be used as treatment for early stage bladder cancer. TURBT is performed completely through a scope called a resectoscope, which is inserted into the urethra while you are under anesthesia, so there is no cutting into the abdomen. A resectoscope is a scope that allows your urologist to see into the bladder. To increase detection and decrease recurrence of tumors, some doctors may use narrow band imaging or blue lights. A tool called a loop is inserted through the scope to remove the tumor. Once the tumor is removed, it will be sent to a pathology lab for testing to determine if the tumor is bladder cancer and if it is, how deep it has spread into the bladder wall. After the procedure, you may have a thin flexible tube called a catheter inserted into the bladder to drain urine for a day or two. It's normal to experience some bleeding and pain when going to the bathroom at first. Make sure you drink lots of water to flush out your bladder and prevent infection. After a TURBT procedure, you usually are able to return home the same day, although sometimes your urologist will want to observe you in the hospital overnight. After your procedure, your urologist may either call you or meet with you to explain next steps based on the pathology of bladder tumor. They will discuss whether the tumor is benign or if it is cancer. If it is cancerous, they will also describe the grade and stage of the tumor, which determines how aggressive the tumor is and its likelihood of spread or reoccurrence. If it is bladder cancer, you may need additional treatments such as another TURBT, intravesical BCG immunotherapy, chemotherapy, and radiation. Your urologist will determine the best course of treatment based on the staging of the tumor. It's important that you talk to your urologist about any questions or concerns you have about the procedure. The TURBT procedure is very safe, but like any surgery, there are some short-term and long-term risks involved. After the surgery, you may experience some bleeding or get a urinary tract infection. It's unlikely, but you may also experience a small hole in the bladder wall. This can occur if the resection is too deep and pierces through the muscle layer. Most bladder holes heal by leaving a urinary catheter in for a short period. Rarely, they will require surgery for repair. One of the long-term risks of the TURBT procedure, especially if repeated, is that the bladder can become scarred, decreasing its ability to hold urine. Some people that have repeat procedures may have side effects such as frequent urination or loss of bladder control, incontinence. For more information on transurethral resection of the bladder and bladder health, visit urologyhealth.org.